Hi, it's Gloria, and today we're going to go over this month's julep. I know um, this is the second month I've got it, and I haven't gotten it in so long because I just have so many nail polishes. But as I've said previously, and uh, I said last month, they have good um, skincare products, and I like their makeup. I do. Actually, but my one of my favorite eyeliners, uh, if not my favorite eyeliner, is the julep. Kajal eye glider or is this eyeliner eye glider yes um, it's got the black on one side the brown on the other um, it just works wonderfully it's the original one and it stays a long time it's long wearing it's very dark it's easy to sharpen so you know for instance some things they get really really well uh, so this month <clears throat> Um, and the thing about Julep now is that you can choose what you want in your box. It's no longer, you know, you have to get their uh, their curated boxes. You can get their curated boxes, but for no extra cost, you can switch out things that you want that are on choice for that month. Um, so that's something else that I like about it. So now I don't have to just get what they sent me. Uh, I got a little bit of a boring box this month. We'll see. So today I get a, a free color with my next julep purchase of $10 or more. Another reason to get maybe another eye glider, you never know. Um, it says, sunshine is good for the soul, but I always make sure I wear a big hat. Miranda Kerr. Miranda Kerr. Miranda. Miranda. Miranda Kerr. No, Miranda Kerr. Um, so uh, this is cool. It's got the tinted love colors. Uh, basically a tinted lip oil treatment, which I did not get this month. I have so many lip things, lip glosses, and you think I'd actually have something in my mouth, but I don't. I've chapped on my mouth. That's what I have. Oops. Um, but you would think that I would have some lipstick or something in my mouth, but I'm about to take all my makeup off uh, because it's in sort of like mid-late afternoon, and I've had my makeup on for like 12 hours, and it's starting to really not look right what does it look like i haven't even looked i should look before i do a video right i could do with a little more uh, under eye concealer but it's all right not that bad okay so what do we have this, this month all right it looks like a nice tidy little box Woo -hoo -hoo. uh because again unlike me i got some add-ons because i had a whole bunch of juleps which are juleps points that's what they call the points is a julep because the company. It's called Julep. Anyway, all right, so I got a little bit of a boring box, uh, mainly because one of the favorite things of theirs on their uh, nail side are their um, top coat. Uh, so I did get their smoothing base coat because I do tend to get some ridges uh, on my nails, and so I got their smoothing base coat. I haven't tried the smoothing base coat yet. I like their other base coats, they're very long wearing um, and this is one of my favorite top coats of all time it is their freedom top coat uh, this is the what do they call it the polymer top coat come here what do you want it's their polymer top coat uh, and it's really fast drying it cures and under natural light um, and it uh, looks shiny enough to be a gel so I really like this particular top coat some people say that they get a lot of shrinkage. I just make sure that I pull it over the tip of the nail. But I have to do that with all my top coats because otherwise I get some shrinkage. So I pull it over the tip of the nail regardless. And I always like, for instance, I always run my brush along the tip and then I put the top coat over the top. Hold on a minute. Rosie, what do you want? Rosie, come here. Okay, beg, beg your pardon, but uh, Rosie here was yowling sort of continuously a wooden hush. Uh, she, you know, she has IBD. I've told you guys that before. She's older on top of that. And um, so she gets, she has a lot of uh, anxiety. Um, she's in pain kind of a lot. It hurts to go to the bathroom. So she hates going to the litter box. Um, sometimes needs a little coaxing. So, um, you know, I don't know how much longer she's going to be around because her, her uh, what do you call it, her bad bouts when she has her flare-ups uh, are getting closer and closer together. Um, 
and there's not a lot more that I can do for her. I'm giving her just about everything that I can, um, short of putting her through chemotherapy or something, because sometimes that works for IBD. And I just think that's cruel. Um, I think that's a little selfish. I think that people just, me, you know, if people are comfortable doing, you know, putting their pets through something like a cancer treatment, um, I get that, but you can't explain to them why they feel so horrible. Uh, so for me, uh, especially at 13 years old, 14 years old, I think that when her bad times start getting a little too close together, you know, that's when it's time to say, you know, goodbye. Right now she seems to be okay, but she does have these, b b things, these bouts of anxiety, um, uh, and just, um, needs someone there and can't quite figure out where anyone is sometimes. So she might be with us for the rest of the, the show. Sorry about that. Say hello. Hello, purry purry kitty. Okay. So let's get back to Julep. Little rosy interruption. That's okay. So showed you the smoothing base coat, the Freedom Polymer top coat. Now uh, let's go ahead and stick with the nail polishes. I went ahead and got some add-ons this month, uh, like I said, because I had the points to spend on it. Um, so I really didn't. Sp I spent very little. I think this month I probably put down maybe ten bucks. And I needed the nail things, and I also need the other stuff that's in there. But these are just the fun things. This, uh, this is a, um, I think this is a, I don't know if they call it a jelly, but it's one of those translucent reds. Uh, what do they call it? Brin. The name of it is Brin. And you can see it has a sort of translucent quality to it. So it is a bit of a jelly, I believe. Uh, or something like that, and it's the ones that they tell you, oh, put it over white for like a bright pop of color, put it on a bare nail for, you know, uh, a sheer wash of color. So it looks nice, um, and it's good for summer. I got this, it's a bit more wintry, but that doesn't matter, I like it. It's called Becky, it's from the It Girl collection, and it looks like a duochrome purple with the, with the green duochrome. And then I got a nice uh, gray sort of cream. It's called Nadra, which just reminds me of Piers Anthony for anyone who read the Zanth series uh, when they were younger. So um, Nadra, I like it. It's a nice, like I said, a nice, like a grayish blue, like a jean blue, like a denim blue. That's it. That was the word I was looking for, denim blue. All right, so the other things that I got in here were, uh, and I, this was in last month's, uh, it's Love Your Bare Face Detoxifying Cleansing Stick. Uh, and I've been using it for this past month. I really like this cleanser. I gotta say, they got the cleanser right. Uh, it's uh, easy to use. It's a little weird when it's in the stick form, since it's, it, okay, now she gets off me. When she's in, when it's in the stick form, uh, but it gets off my makeup and doesn't over dry my skin. Yeah, it's really good. Like when I like their skin clean, their skincare, I really like their skincare and I really like this. Love your bare face detoxifying skin clean, uh, stick, cleansing stick. I like it. Uh, if you wear a lot of makeup and you're looking for something easy to remove with, this works. And it has just a little bit of suds, very light suds. And I think that that's the difference be between their cleansing oil because this has a lot of the same oils and then it has a little bit of a, of a foaming agent in, in it. Uh, and it works well. They did good. They've done good. The other thing that I haven't had for a while and I like it and I needed some uh, eye primer, their Blight Cavus eye primer. It works really well. I like it a lot. Um, the only uh, complaint I ever had about it was that it seemed like there wasn't enough in it. Um, like maybe there was only enough for a month and a half or something. And let's face it, something like a primer, you expect to last longer, you know? It's not like putting on an eyeliner or something because you're putting it on a nice, clean, bare, freshly prepped skin. Um, and I was a little disappointed in that. So hopefully they've addressed that problem. I, I think that they did reformulate uh, because I think there were people who were saying the same thing. I'm wondering if the uh, packaging is the same or not. 
If I can get an out. Get out. Uh, and for anyone who wears a lot of eyeshadow, a good eye primer is important. There we go. Uh, no, it looks like it still has the same packaging, but um, hopefully, like I said, they've put more in there. But I liked their, I liked the uh, applicator. I liked the wearing. It was good and long wearing. Uh, and then, as almost always, there's a piece of candy. Looks like a piece of bubblegum. Bubblegum. And I have never been one to say no to bubblegum or a jawbreaker. I hope this is a bubblegum, not a jawbreaker, because there are probably some ladies that have bitten into a jawbreaker not knowing what they're getting into. Hold on. I'll let you know. Oh, bubble. Well. Mmm. Bubblegum. Bubblegum. Mm hmm. Mm hmm. Yep, it's bubblegum. Bubblegum's good. I can just tell. I can feel my teeth rotting in my head. Chewing on this bubblegum. It's all sugar. <laughs> Talk about going back. Talk about going back to my youth, right? All right. Hopefully, you can understand what I'm saying because I have this ginormous wad of bubble gum in my mouth. I feel like I have chaw. I feel like I got a big old ball of chaw in my mouth. All right. This month's, well, my version of this month's julep box. These are my choices. I use my points. Didn't spend very much. It's got little glittery things. As always, it's nicely packaged. Um, so even if you don't have need for a whole bunch of nail polish, Julep does have a lot of other stuff. Like I said, I got more nail polish than usual this time. I don't need any, but it was I got some for free, so why not? Um, but like I said, I like their basics, like their top coat, their base coat, their skincare, their makeup, all good. Anyway, thank you very much for watching. Um, I'm going to keep chewing this gum. You know, it's one of those pieces of gum that's just going to lose its flavor in like two minutes, so I might as well enjoy it while I can. So, it's a rainy, overcast, gloomy, cold spring day in the Northeast. And I know that in other parts of the United States, like Texas, for instance, flooding, horrible flooding. And I hope everyone's all right. Um, and if you're all right and you have the ability to pay attention to things like this, hope that you enjoyed this. I um, hope it gives you an idea of what to expect from Julep, what you can and can't do with the boxes. Um, and I hope uh, that you're all safe. All right. Well, thank you so much for watching. Remember, you can follow me on Instagram. You can follow me on Twitter. You can find me on Facebook. I have my WordPress blog account. And as always, thank you so much for watching. Much love.